for my birthday last year, we showed the cartoon Hobbit. Do you know any of the songs? Ah, I forgot them. We know them. We know some of them. Well, then like, sing like, them. The greatest adventure is what lies ahead. Yes. And there's clean the dishes, clean the plates. That's what build the baggage states. The Hobbit! From looks alone, who's your favorite dwarf? Killy. Thor. I like Bomber. Balling, because he looks like Santa Claus. Biffer. He looks fun. Thorin. I like Balin. He's got that nice uh, white beard going on there. Bomber, because he's like really fat and chubby and it's adorable. I want to go for Feely, because he, he's got braids. He looks sort of cool. I have to say this one. Which one is that? Throne? Oh, Thorin? Oh, yes, Thorin. So what is the movie going to be about then, from what you can tell? People going on a journey and never coming back. About some bad guys fighting with the good guys. Frodo and Gob... Goblins and trolls and a bunch of icky stuff. See, I'm confused because it says THE Hobbit, but there's like a bunch of little people in this movie. It's about the Hobbit's adventures before the ring came. It's telling about like a separate adventure of Bilbo, how he like, finds the ring and everything. And did you know that The Hobbit and The Lord of the Rings were all books? No. I think I did. I think I heard it somewhere. Yeah. I just read The Hobbit. Oh, uh, yeah, I knew that. Yes, I did actually. Did you know The Hobbit was written in 1937? What? <laughs> I didn't know it was that old. Wow! It's like 80 years old. That's crazy. They waited that long to make a movie? That it was a long time ago. Is that good? Is that bad? It's good because it's popular, and it's bad because it's so old. Do you think it, when you get older you'll want to read them? I have to say yes because this sounds like an interesting book just from the title and stuff. You'll be like, ooh, it's a hobbit. Ooh.